In the past year, motivational content has gone insanely viral. This channel right here is receiving 7 million views per month, and the best part is that these videos are incredibly easy to produce. They're generating approximately $21,000 in passive income every month. In this video, I will demonstrate how to establish an entire channel like this one. I won't only cover video creation, I'll guide you step by step through the entire process, starting with channel creation and ending with thumbnail design. But before diving into the tutorial, let me share some real results people are posting on Twitter regarding their earnings from using cash cow channels. These may not be precisely the same kind of videos, but they pertain to automated YouTube channels in general. Now that we've agreed that this can be done, let's begin the tutorial. We'll start with the first step, which is making your YouTube channel and giving it a unique identity. The very first thing you need to do is create a Gmail account if you don't already have one. After that, you can create your YouTube channel. Once your channel is set up, we'll ask ChatGPT for some name ideas. You can request 10 suggestions for a name for your motivational channel and choose the one you like the most. Then you can also ask ChatGPT for a brief description of your channel. To get started, open up your YouTube studio. Then scroll down until you find the customization section. Inside that, click on basic info. Now return to ChatGPT and copy the name you want for your YouTube channel. Paste it into the channel name field and keep trying different names until you find one that's not already in use. After that, go back to ChatGPT and copy the description you made earlier. Paste this description into your YouTube studio. Lastly, remember to add a different email address than the one you initially used to create your channel in the email address section. Now we need to add a logo and banner. Go to canva.com, then create a design and search for a YouTube logo. On the left side, you will find a variety of templates to choose from. Some may require Canva Pro, but others are free. Select the one you prefer, then change the name to the one you previously chose. You can also customize the background and other elements, but I personally like it as it is. When you're finished, click on Share, then Download. I also recommend downloading two files, one with a background and the other without a background, just in case you need them in the future. To do this, check the transparent background box. Next, we need to create a banner. Search for a YouTube banner and follow the same process as we did for the logo. Now, we need to upload both of them to YouTube Studio. Unfortunately, the banner may not fit correctly, so I will need to remake it. Remember to also upload your logo into the video watermark section. Now that we've finished setting up our YouTube channel, let's move on to the next step, which is making a script for our video. There are two ways to do this. First, you can go to ChatGPT and ask it to create a 10-minute script for a motivational video, along with suggesting the stock footage you should use as the video background. ChatGPT will help you put everything together, making it simpler for you to edit later on. Another way you can make a script is by looking at popular videos. Here's how. Go to YouTube and find a video from one of those big channels with lots of views. Copy the web address of that video, then head over to a tool called DupDub. There, you can paste the video's web address and click on Transcribe. After waiting for about a minute, you'll have the video's words written down for you. Now, take that text and go back to ChatGPT. Ask it to rephrase or rewrite the text for you. This way, you'll end up with an original script that's designed to work well with YouTube's algorithm. Once you have your script ready, the next step is to create the voiceover. There are two ways to do this. First, you can use a text-to-speech software that you like. I recommend using either Eleven Labs or DubDub. After you've chosen one, pick a voice you prefer. I suggest the Atom voice. You can also adjust the voice settings if you want to customize it. Then. Take the script we made earlier and paste it into the text-to-speech tool. You can start by copying the first paragraph and do the same for the rest of the text. Now, let's listen to how it sounds. If you want to achieve success in this endeavor, you must possess an unwavering determination. Understand that this journey is akin to a fierce battle, and you must actively engage in the fight. 
Life won't always be a smooth ride, and no one will hand you your desires on a silver platter. Now the second method is to make a copy of your own voice. You can also use Eleven Labs for this. What you'll need to do is upload some recordings of your own voice. This helps the software understand how you say different words and sounds. It then uses this information to mimic your voice. This way, you won't have to record new audio every time you want to create a new video. I've got another extra tip for you if you don't want to use your own voice or AI-generated voices. You can use pre-recorded motivational speeches from famous people like Andrew Tate or David Goggins. Here's how. Take their speech audio, remove the original video, and then add your own stock footage. By doing this, you can avoid any copyright problems, and your videos will have a better chance of becoming popular. Now that we've finished all our previous tasks, it's time to work on editing the video and bringing everything together. We'll be using a website called v.io for this, and you can find the link to the website in the description if you'd like to help me out. To get started, create a new project on v.io and import the voice recording we made earlier. This website has a bunch of handy tools that will make the video making process a lot smoother. You can enhance the video by adding stock footage on top of the voiceover, and you can easily find these stock clips using the suggestions ChatGPT provided. Plus, you can add background music directly through the same website. Just search for the type of music you want, whether it's motivational or chill. The best part is that V.io also allows you to automatically include subtitles, keeping viewers engaged and preventing them from clicking away. If you want to achieve success in this endeavor, you must possess an unwavering determination. Understand that this journey is a kick. This looks perfect. Now just export the video to your device and you are good to go. Now that we've finished all the previous tasks, let's delve into the final step, creating the thumbnail design. To do this, follow these precise steps. Start by opening Photoshop and creating a new project with the specified dimensions. Next, import a dark background to set the stage. Then, click on Blur and select Gaussian Blur. This technique shifts the focus to the picture rather than the background, creating a more visually appealing effect. Now, import the picture you wish to use. In my case, I'll be using a picture of David Goggins. To remove the background effortlessly, utilize the Quick Selection tool and select Select Subject. Photoshop will automatically eliminate the background for you. Once the subject is selected, click on Add Layer Mask, located in the bottom right corner. Proceed by resizing the picture, positioning it on the right side of the thumbnail. After that, select the picture again and head to the Filters menu, this time choosing Camera Raw Filters. Apply the settings as demonstrated in the video, Add text of your choosing, resize it, and give it a drop shadow to enhance its visual appeal. Additionally, consider adding some outer glow to the picture to make it stand out even more. Finally, after completing these steps, export the thumbnail to your computer, and you're all set to go. All you have left is uploading the video, and be consistent until you see results. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe for more, and subscribe for my email list if interested. Watch this video.